Foot Moody Sailboat. I'm Kim. <laughs> and this is Steve. We bought our sailing boat in October 2019 and are planning to sail the Med for a couple of years. Glad you put your uh, little wetty on. Oh, yeah. Water is freezing on the bottom. <laughs> Steve's swimming. We have successfully uh, dropped her anchor, but I did it a new way. So instead of using the windlass to drop the anchor, I Steve showed me how to loosen it off so the chain just or the anchor and the chain just drops out of the boat really quickly. So, but in doing that, because it's the first time and they've got these little markers on the chain, but they're not really, really clear. So we just wanted to let out like 20 meters of chain. And I think we've let out <laughs> twice that. So there's four colors in the chain, which as it was running out, I just didn't get to see any colours. <laughs> Give him a big okay to say she's dug in. I'm glad he's had a visual inspection. I can relax now and go for a swim. Throw a line off the bow yeah. to hold you there. The broom's actually very effective.
spent a couple of hours in the water scrubbing Mimpy's bottom and just had some lunch, deciding what to do next. that we'd paint the chain and the reason for that is that uh, when we were letting it out it was very difficult to see what the marks indicated for depth. So to start with we laid the chain out in 10 metre lengths from the anchor all the way back and we marked them with tape so that the last bit uh, on the 10 metre, so that's the 10th the metre, uh, had a bit of tape on it and then we chose some colours and uh, so we've got 70 metres of chain all up. Excuse me, what? We've got 70, seven zero metres of chain. <laughs> so we've got red, white, green, because we didn't have yellow, otherwise, otherwise it would have been a stoplight. Red, yellow, green. Then we had blue, Kimmy's favourite. And then we've got black, green, red. And what we're going to do is just put a, a little template over it and just put stripes on those last three. We'll do that after they've dried. The first three colours we'll paint again. Yeah. We won't worry about the blue again. Here in the galley we have a little rubbish bin. As you can see, it sort of suspends itself above the little cupboard that's just here. And what we're doing is looking at options so that we don't uh, lose this bench space. This bench space just here we'd like to be able to put things on top of it. In the cupboard below, you can see I've taken the hinges off. In the cupboard below, I'm going to put a shelf about halfway here so that we'll cut the cupboard off somewhere around here. And so the shelf, we'll the cupboard at the bottom, and we're going to put a bin that tilts out of the cupboard 